All right. So uh, thank you guys for coming. I know we're starting a little bit early, uh, but I want to, you know, introduce you to, you know, our good friend Demetrius. He is an absolute star. Uh, and as I was saying before, he is, you know, there's only a handful of really genuine people in our niche and we really trust him. And we know he he just has a superpower of knowledge behind him. And today he's going to be going through some things about Bing ads. We've had a lot of questions about Bing and Bing ads. And when when I got those questions, I, you know, I know a lot about Bing as well. Uh, uh, but I just thought of Demetrius and I thought this is the go-to guy uh, for Bing ads and making real profits with Bing. So uh, if you've got any questions, feel free to just chime in and ask us questions throughout the um, uh, throughout the session today. He's only got about an hour, so let's let's uh, let's see how we go. Let's make um, it happen. Well, before I start, I just wanted to say to you guys that well, when I'm not here to promote a product of mine, okay? So we so I want people to stick around because we're going to do a proper training. I'm going to teach you the basics and what you need to look out for and we'll create a campaign or whatever if, if you want. I've got a couple of uh, campaigns running right now, um, but in general, I, I, I Bing was always my go-to place because Facebook is always strict, Google's always been strict, uh, always had ups and downs, shut, accounts shut down from all these places. And Bing was always the place where <laughs> if everything fails, Go back to Bing, uh, kind of thing. So it's always been in one of my ad sources for various things. It's not something that I, I scale my business with, but it's one of the most cheapest traffic sources that could get you results if you're starting off new. It, I think it's the best place to get to get acquainted with uh, affiliate marketing and and paid traffic that you can afford. Just wanted to put it out there. give you a little overview. Just We'll leave you to it, mate. Okay. Um, I'm going to put my camera off. All right. Yeah, same here. Okay. You, you know how to share the screen. You know how to use GoToWebinar, yeah? Uh, yeah. Let me hold on because it's been a – let me just start sharing my screen, right? Hold on. Yeah. Hold on. Um, sharing. All right. Uh, hang on. Let me make yeah. presenter. That's oh, I got to I got to be the presenter. Yeah, I did it for yeah, you. Yeah, there man. we go. There we go. All right, better. Uh, I need. Awesome. Okay, tell me if you can see my screen. If you can yeah, see. I can see your screen. Yep, see okay. everything. All right, so you can see the dashboard. Can you see my face anywhere? Uh, just so I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. You're on camera too. Okay, I'm on camera, and you can see my my screen. Correct. Perfect. Yep. Okay. Yep. All right. So let's uh let's start off with uh. Uh, let's go to ClickBank, basically. I'm going to bring it over here. So you can see ClickBank, right? Yep. Okay, cool. So we're good to go. Let me move this to the right and to the right. Okay, so welcome. <laughs> and welcome mm -hmm. to my a little, uh, well, training episode. Now, I'm doing this training um, as clear as possible, step by step, whatever, and and then I'll explain along the way. Is there a place where I can see questions? Um, yeah, yeah. So if okay, you, uh, there's a questions tab, but I can read them out to you if they come. All right. As well, soon so as they when come. there's a question, please let me know so I, I don't get distracted. And yeah, please. cool. Abajit is saying bada bing bing. <laughs> bada bing bada boom. All right. So um, I'm yeah. going to log into my ClickBank account. And right now, um, you're going to see some results, but it's not all from Bing ads, but it's part of it as well. Some of my campaigns that are running right now, uh, I was doing it on purpose to get some results. So this is my 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 snapshot, my weekly snapshot. It's not fake, it's real. And if you can see my affiliate last month, I made about 5,500 something dollars, okay? So I'm, I'm currently around $2,000 right now and it's not even, uh, it's not, even, we're in middle of February. All right. So ClickBank is a good place for everybody to get started. And I think it's the most easiest place to uh, to figure out affiliate marketing. All right. So the first thing that we're going to do today is find an offer to promote on Bing, basically. OK, we're going to we're going to take it step by step and show you all the, the, the things that you want to look at. So the first thing that I'm going to do is click on Marketplace and come over to find products. And everybody probably uses it. You know, everybody knows this, I'm pretty sure. But when I click on this little magnifying glass, it gives me the top 10 
offers that are being sold right now um, from affiliates all over the world, okay? And this is where you want to be at. Like you, you can choose like okay, top 50 products, for example, and we can scroll down and decide what would make sense for us to promote on Bing. Now, I would, in, in my case, if somebody's starting off new, I would really focus on basically promoting things that are not, um, that you're not going to be in trouble for. Of course, Bing has some policies around, uh, but there's, there's an angle, there's always an angle in promoting things. And in my experience, if you're brand new, I would not go for the the tough ones, uh, the ones that you feel are you might get um, disapproved, for example. OK, uh, some of them, maybe diabetes could be one. Uh, these flat belly fixes and stuff. It's it's a tricky one. Yeah. And the reason why is because you don't know how to. Um, well, I don't know you, but mostly most of the people, they don't know how to 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 name things uh, to to. Like, for example, um, I'm going to show you some examples that this is coming from Bing. Like, there's a way of saying things, okay, where you would get disapproved if you said save money today uh, instead of save more money in general. Uh, let's see another one. I, I, wanna, I, wanna, I want you to understand what I'm, what I'm saying. Like, even with the weight loss, uh, you can't say lose weight now, uh, lose weight in in three hours, you can't say that, but you can say uh, you can lose weight with our program in a few weeks. Uh, you're allowed to. There's a, th so there's, there's a little thin line of, of knowing how to angle it, right? We don't want to put a lot of claims. We, we don't want to do that. We don't want to promise things that you can't, that it's not true. And it's something that people don't get. And you, you want to be like such a, a marketer to sell but you're, you're being very aggressive. And when you're being aggressive, you're gonna get your account shut down and everything like that. So my, my, my suggestion is to always start off small uh, with, with things that would, you know, it's, it's not big claims kind of thing. One of them could be parenting and families. That's a, that's a great place to, to get started. Um, there's there's a, lot of, a lot of offers here that you can promote on Bing, for example, without having any problems. I remember back in the days when I was starting off, I was promoting uh, potty training. Uh, there was a, an offer with potty training and I built a landing page to collect leads and everything like that. So anyway, I'm just giving you an example of, you know, what you should look at in terms of uh, products to promote. Don't go all hard with, with the, the tough ones, like the weight loss ones, the make money online ones. Uh, these are tough to get started with, okay? Uh, if you're basically if you're new, anyway. So I'm gonna go ahead and find a product right now that we can promote on Bing without having really any serious issues. I'm gonna go with Ted's Woodworking because it's something that is um, it's evergreen. It's a great product. It's got a lot of tools that you can use straight off the bat, okay? So. Uh, this link that I'm going to right now is the uh, JV link for Ted's Woodworking, and it gives you, it provides you with a lot of, uh, a lot of, uh, what do you call it, content to give or to build from. All right, uh, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna do something different today because a lot of you want to get started and you don't want to build a page, you don't want to build a landing page, you don't want to build a we're going to do direct linking basically okay we're going to be testing an offer by doing direct linking with all the all the stuff that they're giving us here and i'm going to i'm going to show you how i'm going to go about doing this yeah so, cool can i just jump in there for a second yes you can um, so guys uh, so uh, a lot of people uh you know on this call they they purchase link bypass and let me tell you guys there, there are many different ways, you know, you can make money with ClickBank. Uh, you, you can still use the done for you pages. We actually have it done. Uh, Ted's Woodworking uh, I done have, for you yeah. page. Uh, no, we have it as well that we've given everyone. 
Um, but but what, what uh, Demetrius is going to show you is a completely different way where Google doesn't let you do this. So you're going to be learning something completely new uh, that we haven't taught you before, which is, which is one of the reasons why I wanted to get Demetrius on. So keep an open mind about that and have a look and really pay close attention to how he's setting this up because it's, yeah, it's so, gold. So basically you, you wanted to learn direct linking, I'm guessing. That's something that you didn't teach. Yeah, I think I, yeah, we've had loads oh, of questions uh, about about that. So I really want people to know that yeah, this is you, why we have. The, I'll show you a trick that, today. I'll show you a trick today, which is awesome uh, that you can uh, direct link basically anything, um, mm -hmm. and it's it's a cool it's a cool setup. You see it, you see it. Okay, so we're gonna do direct linking. So it's gonna be faster. It's gonna get us real results real quickly to to test and then we can build and then the page that for example David has for you or Wayne has for you you can use it to make more conversions when once you find the winning offer for example something like that so the anyway uh, we're going to promote uh, woodworking and I'm going to go into my Bing ads account right now and we're going to build a campaign from scratch okay so you can see I've been testing out flat belly tonic you can promote flat belly tonic you can promote keto. Uh, I'm actually stuck with the uh, scribble right now. I've been making some good conversions on there. So I've been testing out a couple of things and these are all based on uh, scribble is like direct linking and everything. But anyway, we're gonna start. You're in Bing. You obviously, everybody has uh, a Bing account, all right? They've made some changes with the, uh, the look of Bing. It, I had an older version uh, that I didn't know, and then the new one popped up, and then it, it was such a mess. <laughs> For my product, my Bing Bang Profits software, people were confused because I was using the older version for training. Anyway, so this is a new Bing. It's uh, Microsoft Ads, as they call it now, all right? And uh, basically what I want to do is I want to send traffic to that direct link, okay? There, there are many options to choose from. The two things that I like to play around with is either visits to my website or conversions to my website. Now, conversions for my website, I would use this if I have my own landing page, okay? And uh, then there I can see what kind of conversions are happening when people sign up to my landing page. So basically, that's a whole different training. Maybe you can call me for another session, David, and we can do um, a landing page conversion type training for this. How about that? Maybe we can do that Sounds later good. in the future. Okay. So the first goal that I want to start with is basically visits to my um, my website, and then I'm going to choose search ads. Okay, not audience ads, search ads. Um, I don't have an explanation of why, but I'm sticking with search ads. Audience ads is a it's 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 different. We want to. I have no explanation. This is how I've learned this. this is what I'm doing. You can test out the audience ads. It's up to you. It's all about testing anyways. But we're going to do search ads and then click on next. Okay. So um, hold on. Uh, I'm, just hope, I'm just trying to see if I click something by accident because I think I've clicked it twice. Wait, hold on. Let me try that again. This is my website. Search ads next. Okay, no, we're good. Okay, so I'm gonna put, uh, I'm gonna name my campaign. So this is gonna be my Ted's uh, wood working. Okay, and um, I'm gonna leave budget. The budget is up to you, but I, from my experience, and I'm gonna tell you right now, is that I think you should focus on spending some money on this. The, the, the first initial seven, three days, three to seven days, I would say a week, okay, if you can stick to it. For a week, I would actually put my budget to like even fifty dollars a day, and the reason why is because you want to spend money on testing a campaign and getting the, the as much data as you can on that campaign, and it will help you in the long run. It's it, what I've noticed about one mistake that I used to always do when I was starting out, and I, trust me, I lost a lot of money with Bing, and it, also during times when I didn't have the budget, and the problem with me back then was I never had a credit card, like a visa visa where, you know, uh, 
I can spend it and then pay for it later on. I only had direct debit, like kind of thing. Whatever I was making, I was spending. So if I didn't have enough money in the month, because believe me, I've started where most of you have started. We're, we're at zero. And it took me about two to three years to start getting something going for me. So I stuck at it, but I was doing a lot of side jobs on the side to make the money so I can spend the money in my me testing things. And I remember I was sweating, like I was really literally sweating when I would wake up the next day noticing that my money just blew and I didn't make any money. Like I remember I was, I was really freaking out when I was losing 100 to $200 every time. And uh, it was painful, but it was also a lesson. And what people usually tell you is start off with $5 a day, $10 a day. Yeah, because they know you can't afford it. But the problem with that is that you're not going to see results. And putting down $5 might even give you a couple of clicks in the day. And that a couple of clicks is not enough. <laughs> it really isn't. So if you're going to go big in any traffic source, you got to always go big in budget wise. So always put that mindset that you're going to be spending money. All right. You're going to be spending money to earn money. You're going to be spending money to test money. So a good place to start would be 20. OK, uh, 20 is a good place to get some good data and everything like that. And then you're going to leave it as um, the standard. All right. The, it's going to go serve uh, as it goes, not instantly. Um, we're going to choose one location, start off with one country. And usually that country would be United States. And the reason why I'm, I'm, I'm saying this is because, to be honest, Bing is usually big in the States, okay, uh, as, as far as from my experience. Now, I might be wrong. Maybe things have changed. But in my, my head, the United States is a good testing point for you to go out and start creating an ad and to test an offer if it converts. If it does, then you can break it down to other, other countries as well. Okay, is that clear? Are we good up to now, David? Are, are we flowing? Yeah, yeah, really good. Okay. Um, no, no real question, so it's fine. It's all okay. good, go for it. So basically, I'm gonna be scrolling down. So we chose the country, we chose a budget, all right? And the next thing I wanna do is make sure I uncheck this little uh, checkbox here. The reason why I wanna uncheck it is because I don't want people not searching uh, for my ads in the same country. They need to be in the same country. People in my targeted locations, okay? Not people in Greece searching in Bing US, whatever. Choose your language, okay? And do not do anything else. Just click on go to next, uh, to the next step. Now, um, what it's asking here is it's giving you like an option to bring in a website and stuff. I'll show you a little trick that you probably know. I don't know if you know some things that I know. I feel like what? It, you know, you didn't know that kind of thing. Well, it's true. A lot of people might not know, uh, even if it sounds simple. So what I'm doing right now is I just went out and got my link and I wanted to see the final URL. I want to see the final URL because I want to I, I want to see where my affiliate link is taking them. All right. So it's taking them to tedsworking.com. So what I want to do right now, real quick is put that in there, all right? And what this is gonna do, it's gonna give me, Bing knows that Ted's Woodworking has been using these keywords and ad groups to run ads, okay? This is what people have been, well, the, the specific domain. So the vendors of this have sent ads, they've created ads, and they've used these type of keywords in their ads, either that be in maybe uh, uh, Google or Bing or whatever. OK, so what's great about this is that you can create, you know, simply, usually what people do. And this is something that I've been taught in the beginning of my career, which I find is wrong, is that they tell you to put put in a keyword and then go out and get like a thousand keywords and throw them in there. All right. No, you're going to be losing a lot of money. Uh, yes, you might be getting a conversion, but it's 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 just a mess. OK, it's a big mess. So right now, what I want to do is I'm going to create three ad groups, okay? Three different ad groups. And in these ad groups, we're going to have keywords in those ad groups. And in these three ad groups, we're going to create three different ads for them, 
And this way we can split test and see what works, what doesn't, and we can cover many areas. And it, it will come out cheaper for you in general, okay? So make sure you always do this. Go first with the vendor, with the offer, and, and check it out. Now you can take it up a notch, okay? And what I mean by, by that is, I'm going to take this, okay, and I'm going to go also to similarweb.com. And the reason why I want to do this is I want to see what else can I get information from. Now, Similar Web is free. Uh, again, it might be something you guys probably know, don't know, I don't know. Uh, but uh, basically, you come here and you put um, your, your, sorry, obviously, I'm going to have issues when it's live, you know, anyway, all good. We're gonna fix it. <laughs> Press and hold. What? What is this? Press and hold. Okay. Capacha. Yeah. All right. This is something new. Hold on. I clicked it a couple of twi times in it. it anyway. All right. So I'm gonna click on that. And what I want to do here is do a little research. I'm doing a little research. I want to see what they're doing. Who else is doing? Where, you see, most is United States. So I, I was right about that. You can see also top tier, United Kingdom is coming up. Maybe I could have promoted in United Kingdom. It doesn't matter, whatever. I'm, I'm going down and it's also showing me like other affiliates that are promoting this. So I'm, I'm just just in, out of curiosity right now. It's, it's been a while since I've done this. I want to see who this guy is because this guy is promoting something and he's definitely promoting woodworking, right? So let's see what he's doing. Look at that. So this, <laughs> all right, so he's doing a quiz type funnel and he hasn't finished it yet. <laughs> As you can see, it's not fixed. He was he was in the process. Oh, wow. That's bad. But it's, but look, he, for some reason, he's he's got like so many visits. I don't know. He's probably making some, I don't know. It's weird. This is weird. Okay. So what I like to always do is actually, um, Go through the funnel. Don't be afraid to put, find a, create a Gmail account. This a, okay, a valid, or maybe, hold on. Always, always, uh, okay, whatever. His stuff is broken, and I don't know. He's losing a lot of money. I don't know what he's doing, but this guy's losing a lot of money. So, it, you see how fast, okay, he's, he's bringing people from direct linking and, and social media. He also has keywords here, organic, that's organic, paid. I don't have paid information. He's doing a lot of Pinterest. Okay, that's something that you can see. And you have a lot of audience categories you can you can use for your um, for your stuff. All right, so yeah, I'm, I'm getting some information about this. I'm just trying to see what other people are doing or where things. So you can do your little research using similar web and seeing what other people are doing, okay? There's another one here. I don't know. I don't know what this is. Um, but you can see also the keywords. Hold on. I had it. A second. All right. Um, again, Pinterest is huge with woodworking. Keep that in mind. Um, Clickbank. Yeah, obviously it's a Clickbank. AdFly. They're promoting something with AdFly. All right. And then we have, um, you see all these, these are similar websites, okay? So another cool trick that you can do is I'm gonna go to this website, okay? So this is my door plans. This is a whole different thing here, all right? So I, what I wanna do is, let's see what this guy is doing. So let me put that in there. And maybe we can find something outside of the box of the usual, what people are looking for, all right? Here's something that we can be using, woodworking. I'm gonna add that group, look at that. These are new keywords that I might have not thought about because of another competitor. Uh, this is really cool because guys, this is what sets the super affiliates apart from anyone else, you know? And you know, just watching Demetrius go through this and how he thinks outside the box and how he connects the dots on his own, 
this is what you need to be doing, guys. You need to be thinking the exact same way uh, because this is really the thing that separates, you know, the the standard affiliate to a super affiliate. Sorry, the, go ahead. The usual person, the, the 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 normal affiliate will always do what I just showed you in the beginning, where I would take woodworking and maybe search for keywords on there and stick there. But here we're talking about you've got an option of finding more stuff more keywords more competitors that are using different keywords that are bringing them money all right and this is something that i haven't shared with anyone not even on my youtube channels about this to be honest i kind of like uh this is it, it's not that it's i i just thought about it but uh, i actually following through with it i knew about this but sometimes i'm lazy because i have tools that i'm using whatever but this is a, a great way to basically find more stuff. Look at this. This is like it changes every time. And these are and these are lower clicks that you can use. And this is gold mine right now. So this guy plays with shed. I don't know if shed might be something that I want to use, but um, let me just get a couple more. I'm gonna do two more ad groups, and then we'll proceed to the um, to the ad. Okay. So. Plans, this is something that we can use. It's the, what is this? Plans, the, I would have never found this if I didn't go through this. And free tools, guys. It's a, you don't need a kind of spy tool or something like that for this. This is a straight a free free tool you can use. And we, again, we're in the, okay, wooden shed, shed, shed. Okay, so let me just go back to uh, to the free floor plans. This, they had some nice little keywords. I don't want to waste too much time on this. I'll just create the couple more. Okay, house plans, woodworking tools. We've done that one. Floor plans. That could be something that we can use. And we'll do a project plan. Let me do that one as well. Okay, so. We're done. I, I what I did here was I chose three different ad groups. Okay, you see it? All right. Save and go to next. Okay, so each of these I need to create an ad for. Now the great thing about this is that once again we come here into the affiliate program that they have for us. They have examples that you can uh, take advantage of. And let me scroll down and see what else they might have for me here. So I can use. So let me go to the affiliate center. Uh, these are two. Oh wait, no, that's uh, two different ones. Two two other different ones. Wait one sec. It's been a while since I come here. All right, blah blah blah. All right, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna do this off the cuff, in a way. So I'm gonna show you what I would do. Okay, this guy giving free plans. Text. Okay, let me go to the text landing page. And the reason why I wanna to go to the text landing page is because it's got a lot of writing. And the, a lot of writing is gonna help me create my ad, okay? So if you, you are clueless on what you need to write as an ad, use this as a, a, um, as a resource to get some information on what it is and create your ad. Okay, so we're gonna create our ad. I'm gonna move this to the right and I'm gonna come back into my account, okay? So I'm gonna create an ad for this one right here. Now in this part, okay, I want you to pay attention. Um, it's got a research ad and an expanded uh, ad thing. I would uh, obviously, I would personally use the expanded text ad. And the reason why it's uh, you have more control of it. Uh, this is more, uh, more of the newbie thing, it will help you create stuff, but we want to, I want to do it exactly like I learned in the beginning. You know, this is me controlling everything and, and everything. All right. Now, final URL. Let's say you don't have a landing page. Let's say you don't have a, a domain. Let's say you don't want to spend on that. You just want to take out an offer. You want to test it out. Well, what does the final URL mean? It means it's the final URL from your affiliate link. Okay. So if I went to ClickBank, and I came and clicked promote, and I generated my hot links. If I put this in my browser, 
you're going to see something. This is going to redirect. You see that redirect? It changed and it took me to this. This is what's this is what I'm interested in. This. This last final URL, whatever it has there, I want to copy that. Okay? I'm going to copy that and I'm going to put it in here. I'm going to put that. Now, you're going to say to me, but Demetrius, my affiliate link is not attached to this. Well, obviously it's not. Don't worry. I got the I got the solution for you, okay? And it's a little bit further down, and it's a cool trick. And this is what's going to allow you to track and basically send direct linking, and without you having an issue with the offer or with Bing. So right now, I'm going to have the final URL as the final landing page, and then here I'm going to create my ad for this. So I'm going to go back into uh, my page and. Uh, I'm gonna put like maybe 16,000 wood plants. We put 16,000 wood plants for free. Start off like that. I'm just playing around with it. Um, and then let me move this to the right so I can write it better. Okay, uh, Microsoft Ads. So the next part would be, um, I'm going to put beat the current team offer. That was seven. No, a grand offer. And I'm going to put like a 7% discount. Okay, I'm just, this is the generic ad that I'm creating. You can be creative, you can do whatever, it doesn't matter. It's up to you. But this, for, for this specific thing, I just wanted to make it quick. So here's another one. Make 16,000 plans with step-by-step -step plans, even if you don't have a large workshop or expand, okay, workshop, scroll down. Okay, and I'll, I'll cut it from there. Instant access to 16,000 plans. See, I'm just, I, this is me right now being creative, okay? Uh, you saw I added something, then something comes up and I'm switching around, so it doesn't really matter. It's try and make it, you know, make sense. Uh, instant access to 16,000, even if you don't have a large workshop. And this is from information from that uh, page, okay, that I'm, I've been doing. or expensive or tools and then add two would be each of the 16,000 projects are detailed enough to leave nothing to guesswork yet simple No, guess what? Mm -hmm. Each of the 16. Okay. All right. And I'm going to leave it like that. So this is what they would see. That doesn't look bad, right? You guys agree? Yeah, it looks, yeah, it looks okay. good. Nick's, would you, would you yeah. click on it? I'm giving 16,000. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm 16,000 wood plans for free. Let's go. All right. Now, um, in this area, you know you sorry, sorry, just one second. Yeah. Uh, Nick just said, this is fantastic. It's really interesting. Loads of stuff that I never knew. So wow. Keep going, man. People loving this. People loving this. Okay, good, 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 good. That, that's the whole point of this show. I'm not selling you anything. Let me remind you, I'm not selling you anything. Because usually the webinars sell you something. This is pure training. All right.
Um, and now what I want to do, uh, this I don't remember, but it's okay. I'm going to, I'm going to uncheck it because I don't remember it and I don't, I don't care. So I'm going to, I'm going to uncheck that. And what I want to do here, just in case, just in case uh, somebody clicks with their mobile, I wanted to be there as well. Cover this area as well. Even though we're not going to be sending mobile traffic, we're going to be sending desktop traffic. Sometimes uh, the system allows people to, I don't know, maybe they were on mobile and you, maybe you're on mobile and you, you, you request a desktop thing. That's what usually happens. I want to cover that because if there's no link there, from my understanding is that there is, they can't, they can't get to it. So I want everybody to always be able to get to it. Now here, here is the magic, the, 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 the tracking, the everything that we're going to get we, because of direct linking. You don't take your affiliate link from ClickBank. Okay. You don't take this link that you, you get from there and you don't put it in here. Okay. Don't ever do that. A lot of people teach you that. Don't do that. What the way you're going to be doing this is you're going to click on add URL options. And then in the, if you have no tracking tool, which I do suggest you do always have a tracking tool, but because we're doing this for total newbies, people that are starting out, want to test the waters, want to see how this all works. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get my affiliate link. Okay. I'm going to click on this. I'm also going to put Bing ads and I'm going to put work working. This is my, this is for me to know that if I make a sale from that ad group of the woodworking ad group, it's going to show up here. Okay. Maybe I, I won't even put like the Bing ads, but I'll put woodworking. It's up to you though. I'm going it's from Bing ads and woodworking. Okay. That my, my ad group, I'm going to generate my link. This is, this will show up the TID. You see this little question mark. You can actually add this question mark. You don't need this, this question mark and TID equals is a universal, should I say, uh, tracking. Uh, you put this on any affiliate link on ClickBank, uh, you'll be able to track and see where your sales are coming from. Anyway, so I'm going to copy this link, okay? And I, uh, this is the direct linking method, uh, blah, blah, blah. All right, so I'm going to go into the ad, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it there, okay? This is what I'm going to do. Now, if I want to make sure that uh, this actually works, I'm going to test it. And you can see that the page was found. That's showing me that Bing is ready to go. Give me the green light. We're ready to go. There's the, I'm done. Okay. So I'm now tracking this. So when I make a sale, I'll know that that ad, that specific ad, let me save it. Okay. Let me save it. This specific ad, if I make a conversion, it, I'll know it came from this, the woodworking ad group with my 17 keywords there. And then from your ad, you can tell who's clicked on what keyword uh, to go more advanced into seeing which keyword has made the sale. That's a little bit more, uh, more advanced and we're not going to do advanced today. Okay. I'm just letting you know. Now to save you a lot of time, copy ad and copy to all ad groups, get it done with. Honestly, now the next thing that I want you to do is basically create another three ads and another three ads, but we're not going to do it here. And the reason why is because for each group, for each ad group, I want you to always have three ads. Always have three ads in the beginning. The whole point that you're doing this is for you to test out everything. Okay. But because I have a method of adding ads later on, I'll show you at the end. I wanted to show you the basic version, manual version, where you today are going to go to ClickBank, you're going to create your ad just like I showed you, and you're going to start off. But I'm going to show you also an automated solution. Obviously, I'm going to be showing you my own uh, software that I have, but I'm not here to promote that. Okay, that's why we want to finish with this fully, because you can do this manually. It just saves you time. What I like to do is create products that saves you a lot of time. Now, ad extensions. This is a... This is something that will help you with conversions, okay? It really will. And I like to usually use action extensions where I'm giving them an option. Like I would say, add new extension, okay? I would say, uh, maybe download now. Uh, view plans. That's perfect for what I wanna do, okay? I'm gonna have 
the final URL obviously is the tabs we're working as as we uh, we we said. Okay, so it's it's the tabs we're working. Hold on, and the same here. And here is where we get our tracking again. Okay, this is an extra layer of of um, of a link. Now I'm going to put here Bing Ads would. Uh, Bing Ads woodworking, and what I'm going to do here is uh, extension. So I know it's if it, if I make a sale from that extension, it's going to tell me I made that sale from that extension. That's huge because then you know oh this little thing that I did here uh, actually worked. So this is going to show underneath the ad. Uh, okay, underneath this ad, it will have like view plans. How perfect is that for somebody to click on it and take them to it? Is that cool? You guys get it? Uh, there are even call out extensions that you can use if you want. It's up to you. What do you want to do? I like to use the action one. It, it, it makes, you know, it adds a little option to whatever. You can also add a price. Uh, like I had 77% discount. You can add them there. It helps, whatever. But I'm going to leave everything as, as is. And I'm going to click on save and go to next. Okay. Now, this is uh, the almost the second to last part of your um, your ad campaign. Are we okay until now? Any questions up until now, David? Can you check uh, out? We're doing good. The only comments we're getting are, uh, let me just have a look. So all new info. This is great from Patty. Uh, Sai is saying awesome class so far. So some really positive comments. Keep it going, mate. They're loving okay, it. Okay, awesome. So right now, uh, this is a this is something that the Bing Ads has changed throughout the times. Uh, you were you were able to do a manual bid and everything. Now they've changed everything. Uh, they made like really they they change everything. So my suggestion to you is is really you can test this up to, it's up to you it really goes with your budget honestly it will go with the amount of budget that you are available to to afford just know that in order for you to be up on the first page it's nobody's saying that you need to be on the first page of bing for you to make sales trust me i've been on pages uh average position pages on third and fifth and and i still made sales it's not about that it's about finding the keywords and connecting the right, you know, uh, during the search and plus the bidding. What I like to do, honestly, when I'm starting out is either I go big, okay, uh, or I, or because I'm testing. People are gonna tell you like, start off, and this is what I used to teach as well, start off small, okay? You can start off small, you can. It's not that you can't, uh, it's just, I, I don't think it's going to it's going to take time before you can see some real results. It, it pushes you back in the pages positions. Yeah, the monthly clicks are lower even though you can still get a lot of monthly clicks from just 32 cents, maybe even 20, okay? It really it's up to what you you can afford. It, that's allowed, you're allowed. Okay? But I'm going to go I'm going to go with dollar a, a dollar. And I like to go with a dollar because it's just a rule that I put and, I, and I've seen that I'm getting, my money is being spent faster. Keep that in mind. If you're on a limited budget, this won't be working. It won't be perfect for you. So you play around with the budget, the, depending on your budget, and you're going to have to stick it in there. If the first month that you're doing ads and you're still not seeing results, don't quit, ladies and gentlemen. Don't do that because that's what I did. And I wasted two years of my time going doing something else and then coming back and then, okay, I'm going to focus, okay? And that's what I've been doing with native ads as well. I've been pushing it back. I've been failing at it and quitting and then coming back every year, trying it again. This year, I said I'm going to become an expert. And that's I'm on the, on the road to becoming an expert. But this, this is the same method. This is the same process that you need to keep in mind. It's whatever your budgets are. And I don't want you to get discouraged. I don't want you to get discouraged from people telling you that Bing is not a good traffic source. Bing wouldn't exist if it wasn't a good traffic source, okay? Bing wouldn't be there if it wasn't a good place. But Bing has a different demographic. Bing has a 40 plus that you're looking for. And ClickBank, ClickBank has a lot of offers for 40 plus, okay? Put that in your head. 
believe it. It's a mindset problem. And it's something that people teach you that is wrong. You should always use Bing. Bing is powerful if you know how to how to flirt with it in a way, okay? So what I want is I want to get more conversions. So that what Enhanced CPC will do, it will, it will automatically change the bids for keywords and everything for you, okay? I just want to get conversions. I, I, I really, I, I don't have, you know, um, I can put like my target CPA and control things and put like $1, up to $1 I want to spend on people um, on 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 my ads, okay, and nothing more. You can control it, so it's up to you what you want to do. I'm gonna leave it as 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 it is right there. Um, this one right here, again, it's more advanced. It's um, uh, it's new stuff for me basically, but it's not something that uh, if you want to spend. Okay, so basically what this is saying is that I my target is telling you telling big. I my target is one dollar. Uh, it doesn't mean I'm people are going to be spending that, okay? But I'm also willing, you know, to spend up to two dollars for a conversion. So it's certain, okay, it's kind of confusing. It's also confusing for me, so I want to keep it nice and simple. My target CPA is one, or I'm going to choose maximize clicks to get uh, more of my com conversions or whatever. Again, you can set uh, your maximize thing, so I don't want to spend more than one dollar. Okay, so get that, put maximize conversions, and let's see what we get from that. You can play around and test it. But there really isn't a, a right method or wrong in this area. There really isn't. It's all about testing. And if I want to test and I want to see what's my average click and what's my average blah, 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 then I will do it the way that you see it. Okay, now, um, if you had more countries, you could edit this part but I'm not going to do that uh, let me just scroll down because they also changed all these as well uh, it, you know uh, let me just go to aha uh -huh, here we go thank god I clicked on this because this is something new in the new method always 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 edit the target categories and it's very important what I'm about to show you as well something that people don't teach you or don't don't focus and since Bing has changed a lot, uh, this is something that's new, okay? So what I want to do here is edit my categories, and I want to go deeper into my demographics. And I know my age groups, okay? Uh, so I want to check out the age groups. I know the gender, so I want that as well. Uh, everything else is fine, okay? And you can see that now I can see the age groups are available right now. So what I'm going to do here is decrease this by 90% because I don't want to target... 18 year olds. I don't want to target 25 year olds either. What I'm targeting is basically 30, 40 and up. So this is basically, basically it. So I'm going to increase this by 90. I'm going to increase these by 90. Mm, yeah, I'll do, I'll do over 65 as well, because a lot of, I've got my neighbor, uh, he's an old guy is in nineties and uh, he's got a little shed underneath. Uh, and the, so he's always working on something. So it's, Perfect. So you can see that that's the perfect age group for me. You guys see this? You guys get this? Now, I also know females are not going to be interested in this, so I'm going to decrease this. But I know males are, so I'm going to increase this. Okay. You don't even really need to uh, put like decrease or whatever, just put it on zero and keep this at 90. Uh, basically, you're telling Bing, I want my, uh, most of the traffic to go there, uh, basically. Okay. So you can. Like the decreasing, that's fine, uh, but it's the same thing as putting zero, basically, okay? And I don't want uh, uh, smartphones and I don't want tablets, okay? I want desktops. Okay, is that clear? Um, I'm not going to – well, the scheduling. It's up to you what you want to do here. If you know – I'm going to leave it to run because I want to test maybe there's people that buy at 2 o'clock in the morning. Who knows? This is for later on if you're whatever. But right now, um, that's it. I think I'm done. And click on save. Okay, so right now, I, I'm i guessing, yep, got it, done. So this is going to run. It's going to start running. And we created our ad on Bing. Okay, but I'm going to show you something extra now. Now I want to I want to I want to uh, make it bigger. 
Uh, I want to create more ads. I want to create, I'm going to add more keywords maybe. Um, I want to track things maybe uh, with my tracking tool. So what I'm going to show you now, are we, are we good with this? Are we, David? Yeah, 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 of course. This okay. is great. All right. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to, I'm going to go to my Bing Bang Profit software. Uh, maybe people know about it. Maybe people don't. I'm not sure. So what I did with this software was basically I said, Alex, to my partner, um, I want to automate my Bing ads. Uh, like I really can't be bothered to go create another ad. I want to spy on my competition. I want to find keywords that are working. I want to track things without knowing any tracking knowledge. Because that's one thing that always held me back was tracking. Couldn't track things, couldn't, didn't have the knowledge and everything like that. Now, we created this software to help with all that, okay? So the first thing that my software does is uh, we find who's promoting what on Bing and also other networks. And the way we do this is we come here and we put like the keyword that we're looking for. So this would be woodworking. Okay, I'm going to choose the keyword and I'm going to choose the country. So I've got the top tier, whatever. I'm going to explore and hopefully I don't run into some issues because sometimes I might run into it. It's a software, it's live, and usually <laughs> shit happens. Yeah, it happens. Sometimes. I'm always, always nervous when I'm playing around. Yeah. With uh, me too. Because when, you, run it, when you, you know, it's like in the back, like, come on, come on. So it's working for now. <laughs> okay. All right. So right off the bat, what do we see? It's a freaking gold mine. Awesome. You see that? Wow. Oh, look at that. That's close to what I put. Now, what do you see? I also see links here. Okay. When I click on this, it won't take me to the site because uh it, it something protects it so what i need to do is play around with the details here and let's see what this guy has oh it's a little banner that's okay. cool that's cool let's see what else do we have put that in there look at this uh this guy's using a group funnels page i already know from this this character right here Okay, so these are all affiliates that are promoting things. Let me show you another little trick. Okay, so it takes you over to we're working. Any steps on? Okay, so if I scroll down, I'll show you another little trick here. Uh, let me go and add this to cart. And let's say you know some kind of, you, you want to see who the affiliate is. You come down and look, it's, it's some guy called show something, show, show, whatever. That's the affiliate. And look, he's doing, this is the tracking thing that I told you. Uh, this guy's using Woodman. I'm, I'm using like, you know, extension or whatever. Well, they're doing the same thing here or whatever. Now, what do I have here? This is, all, this is a whole gold mine. So remember when I told you I wanted to fill in the other ads and I can't be bothered to create another ad? Now watch this. I'm going to choose this one because it makes sense for me to use. I'm going to use this because it makes sense to use. I'm going to use this as well. We're working over 60. Why not? Let me use that one as well. That's good from the same guy. And yeah, I'll do that. Now watch this. <laughs> this, this is the magic. You guys ready? Create Bing ad. Let me refresh this. Now this is already integrated with my Bing ads account. It communicates. Okay. So you remember I had all these offers and remember we created the Ted's woodworking. It's right here. So I'm going to choose that. It's already showing up. Okay. And now I'm going to choose, you remember the, the groups that we created? They're all here. Woodworking, floor plan, project plan. Remember the, the, the final URL? It already provides me with the final URL. And watch this. Okay. What did I just do? Well, what am I doing? I'm actually pushing these ads over into my account. That's cool. Wait. That is very this is this is just the cream of the 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 the, 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 the little big ass cake that I have to eat. Okay. Add successful added to the campaign. So I'm gonna head over now. Okay. I didn't do anything. This is live. There you guys see me working this. Okay. So I'm gonna click on that. 
Okay, you can see the thing here. Now I'm gonna click on the uh, woodworking one. And I'm gonna go to, oh, actually my bad, the ads, ads part of it. Okay. Oh, this got disapproved for some reason. Violation of display URL, not allowed in the States. Okay. Now I think that's I a it's very, very is hard it, offer. Yeah, I think I think there's a keyword or that. That's fine. It's uh, something's not something's not right because everything else is fine. <laughs> but, okay, so mm. for that specific one, I don't know whatever. We're not worried about it. We'll fix it. But you can see that. Hey, look at that. That's the one that I just brought in. That's the other one. That was fast. That, that's a huge time saver right there. Huge time saver. This is a. I'm done. Okay. Now I'm going to go back into my account. We've done the first part. Now, what do I want to do next? Let's see what keywords are these guys using for this specific one? Because you, have, you first have to go to competition, get it, and then you go to Bing Suggest. It won't work the other way around. It works with whatever ads that I was working with. Look at all this. Look at all this. What's giving me here is the information on what's working, what's not, okay? What people have paid for, what conversions. So I can filter this and let's say I wanna, uh, I want a CPC cost, my cost per click. I want it to be, uh, is less than or equal to $1 and apply. So I'm gonna get all the keywords that are under a dollar and I'm gonna go ahead and add them into my woodworking uh, offer here, my ad group one. I'm gonna put, I don't know, I'll put I'll put a dollar because that's what I'm doing anyways. And then you can choose here on what you can use. You can actually do exact and push them over. I've already got the keywords, remember? So we don't need to play around with the, the broad face. I, I wanna bring some exact keywords because I know these are working for these guys, correct? So wouldn't that make sense for me to put it in my ad? Yeah, there's no point reinventing the wheel there exactly. at all. Exactly. So if I go into my keywords now, that's how fast it is. Uh, they're all added. If I go down, uh, wait, I need to refresh, I think. One sec. Okay, and you see that um, you see the exact options, um, et cetera. So while you're waiting for that to load, we've got Ida saying, I have Bing Bang Profit. Uh, it's a really cool tool. Cool. Thanks, Cedar. Excellent. Awesome. You can see the keywords have been added exact. Okay. Exact, exact. These are the ones that I just added. And plus the other ones that I already have that are running. Okay. And now we have a lot of uh, pending editorial review. Okay. I see what's working here. Uh, All right, that's got to do with my titling of my ad. That's no problem. It's things that I can fix. So we're done with that. Okay, we've added the keywords. Okay, so what do I want to do next? Well, I also want to track. Now, one thing that a lot of people want to learn is how do we track Demetrius with um, uh, knowing which keyword has converted for us, uh, et cetera, blah, blah, blah. All right. This is something that uh, I had a problem with understanding. I had to get uh, um, uh, I, tracking tools, obviously. Uh, Click Magic was one. Uh, a lot of people like to promote that. I used to promote it. I still do. It's not that it's not a good uh, tracking tool. But what we wanted, I wanted to make it a lot easier in a way of, uh, I, wanted, I wanted people to come, be able to get their links and be able to, uh, figure out which keyword has converted for them, et cetera, okay? So for example, I'm gonna show you one example of one campaign that has to do with surveys, all right? So I was running this campaign and then suddenly when I made a sale, I if I click in this, the cool thing is that I know which keyword, okay, made that one sale for me. Now, what can I do with this? I can take this and go and create new ads on Bing and focus on that keyword because I know this is the one that's bringing me money. And the way that you do this is very simple. I'm gonna come into my link tracking tool. I'm gonna add my link 
And this one is my wood working, working uh, Bing campaign, uh, Bing ads. Uh, let me put let me put David just so I know which one it is because I've done a lot. And I'll name it work, working whatever. And I'm going to choose the affiliate network. So this is ClickBank that I'm using. Uh, Bing ads that I'm doing and then the link that I'm going to get from the primary the primary ring link link okay I'm going to get it from here so hold on okay I'm going to copy it as it is and I'm going to come back into my option right here and I'm going to add it there okay I'm going to inject tracking it's going to add my tracking so I know it's from Bing ads and then uh, and then add and then I'll scroll down this is it and what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna set tracking and I'm gonna put it I'm gonna, uh, in my Ted's word working in this area and I'm gonna set tracking URL is set now if I go back into my ads account Okay, and if I go to my, uh, where is it? Uh, 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 I think it should be this. Oh, now it's eligible? Hey, it just went eligible, by the way. The one that was disapproved. I guess they made a mistake. Yeah. Themselves. So all good. See, see, I wasn't wrong. This is going to start running. Now, if I scroll down, remember before we put in our uh, link, look at this now. Remember in this area, I had something else here, remember? That was the uh, direct linking method that we did that you can still use, so you can, whatever. But what my trafficking software did was it, it got injected into my campaign and now I'm tracking everything. Every click <laughs> is gonna happen on my map. That is cool. Okay, and from that, I'm gonna be able to know, is it a broad match? Is it a, you know, just everything is here that you're gonna be able to play around with. Now I have more options here that you can go out and you can split test as well. And I know you've got a split testing tool uh, yourself, David. Well, this is for Bing. And you can actually create yeah. a, a split test from the ads and see what works, what doesn't and remove. And it works on autopilot, but I'm not gonna go in detail. There's more, uh, there's no reason for it. I wanted to show you how easy it was for me to just create more ads. I wanted to show you how I was able to get more keywords I wanted to show you how I was spying, spying on other affiliates that you wouldn't have the possibility of doing so because the way we built this is, is you won't find it anywhere else and it's plus it's a one-time price. But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, that's how you do Bing ads. I don't know awesome. what else. Um, awesome, no, that's great. That's great. Thank you so much, man. That's awesome. I know you said you're not, you know, you, you, you're not selling anything or anything like that and we really appreciate it but we do have a few people uh that have asked so if you just give me a yes in the chat box if you think that training was cool and also give me a yes in the chat box if you want us to send you the link privately uh, if you want to start using add this tool uh to your toolbox all right we got yes 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 all right cool so what i'm going to do guys uh, well okay loads of people saying yes so what i'm going to do i know you i know you didn't want to sell uh, we don't need, we need, I don't know. We guys, we didn't even create a link or bonuses or anything. This was not talked about. Yeah. Um, yeah. I, that's why I, did, I wanted to say in the beginning that I'm not doing this to sell, uh, but I need to show you the, the automated process as well, because it's basically automating your whole campaign using my software and training as well. There's also training in there. But again, we weren't, we, you know, I know a lot, like you've seen the beginning of the start, how we started. <laughs> it was like, you know, I, I, I went, I mean, yeah. I'm trying yeah, to. Cool. So I'm, I'm, I'm just going to give you guys the link. This is not an affiliate link, guys. We don't make any money from this. I want you guys to support uh, Demetrius. I'm going to send you guys the link right now uh, for those of you that said yes to it. Uh, so I'm just going to drop that now. Uh, like we said before, not a sales webinar, but hey, it's a freaking cool tool. And do you, yeah, want, you need do to you have want, this. Do you want the? Uh, do you want? Do you want your affiliate link to promote it to your link? No, man. Okay. Not so at all. We don't need. Bing, no, man. Bing, no, I've sent it to put, everyone already, man. Bing, bang, <laughs> profit. 
Put bingbangprofits.com. That's it. It's on ClickBank as well. Uh, yeah, I've got the one called bingbangpro.com forward slash BP, BBP, that one. Uh, let me see. Wait, hold on. Yeah. Look, there's two two, two ones. Uh, there's one that we're selling on ClickBank and there's one that we're selling All right. on... Uh, on uh, so, okay, cool. So bingbangprofits.com. I'll just give you guys that link yeah. too now. Uh, so there we go. So bingbangprofits... Dot com. And I, I, I launched this two years ago and it's still running today, as you saw. Um, just the training, uh, I need to revamp the training because of the new uh, layout and it's it still works the same. It's just they change things around so it looks newer. Yeah, yeah, yeah cool. So I hit the correct link, guys. I'm just I've got it on my share um, on my on my page. Yeah, yeah. Com. cool guys i know i know this wasn't a sales webinar but man we've got no jokes like 20 people that have said yeah i need to get this uh because because seriously it is a cool 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 tool you guys so, saw it so live. Guys, you guys saw it live everything that we and it worked yeah. thank god it worked flawlessly thank you alex yeah <laughs> you know what whenever i'm doing a live or something i always tell my developers i'm like my i got like a team of four developers and i say guys do not make any updates at all <laughs> i'm doing a live today because you just never know sometimes they just jump in and they want to you know fix you know whatever you've got in the roadmap and add more features uh but uh, firstly man i, I just want to say thank you so much the comments that have come through have been so positive uh, about this training today people are saying things like i've never ever known this this is completely fresh completely new to them uh so it was spot on the training you delivered today uh, was spot on for this audience. Uh, they, they're at the, that exact stage where you know you met them at the right right uh, spot. I'm, there. I'm glad because it really went well. I enjoyed this training as well. There was no hiccups whatsoever. It was yeah. such. A, I want this recording, by the way, so I can share it with my list yeah. um, when you're done. Definitely, definitely, I think, definitely. I think, it's, I think it's a powerful training for anyone to get started with Bing. This is exactly what you need to be doing. And you know what? We're giving you the option of not even building your own page for this. You go out, test offers, put out five, ten, twenty dollars, get that one conversion, and then you'll see that you believe the system works. That the process is about focusing and focusing yeah. on one area until you become an expert. And that's what I'm doing with native ads, for example, right now. I've, I've been put a lot of my time, a month and a half, and a lot of money, three thousand dollars spent, made half. So lose a yeah. win and become an expert. Yeah. That's cool, man. Really appreciate it. Loads of people saying thank you. Uh, absolutely awesome training. Great training. Like loads of people chiming in. So th thank you so much. Thank you, everyone. And for those of you that jumped in a little late, don't worry. We're going to have a replay and we're going to be uh, uploading it to your members area as soon as possible. So I want to say one last thank you to everybody. Thank you, Demetrius, for jumping on. I know you've got to go and meet your wife now. So <laughs> thank you so much, guys. And we will see you on the next masterclass. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Bye bye. Hold on, I think I'm still live. Wait, hold on.